And uh, yeah, that's about it. Uh, life update. Everything's going well. Uh, my work, you know, YouTube recently, my views went down a lot. And, uh, <laughs> yeah. How did this guy even catch up to me in the first place? Like, yeah, I know I break for that woman and then he passed me, but how did he get that close? Because he's not that quick. You know, I, I, I'm, I'm finding I'm not having a difficulty repassing him here. I'm definitely quicker than him, so. See, I'm, I'm kind of confused by that. That woman caused me to break for a second and then he shot by, but. And then as soon as I got behind him, I'm like, I passed him again easily, so. How did he catch up to me in the first place? Uh, sometimes what happens is people are quick when they're following your line, and then when they pass you, they don't know, they don't have a line of their own, so then they slow back down again. It's always easier to follow than just to lead, right? Uh, yeah. Uh, yeah. So my yeah, my website. I'm gonna organize my. Uh... <laughs> I got uh, mesmerized by that clock there, the clock with the red numbers. You ever notice if you look at if you look. Uh... If you look at an LED clock and you make a, a, a rumbling sound like, like, like that, the numbers will bounce. I remember as a kid, I used to do that a lot. I was like, because the numbers really bounce. They like bounce a lot. It's like the bounce suns. It looks like they bounce right out of the clock. You know what I mean? And those numbers are, wow. I guess they're not doing it for you, but those numbers are like, they're moving like a foot each of them, and not together. Like the the, the, the there's three numbers. The one on the far left move a foot up. One next to it would move a foot down, and then as they get closer, they bounce less and less. But at a distance, they're just they're bouncing tons. You know what I'm talking about? <laughs> if you got an LED clock, just try it. Just look at an LED clock, uh, especially in a dark room, and then just make some kind of a, a bassy rumble sound, and the numbers will wobble. So yeah, so check out my website. That's like 80% joking. And uh, check out the forums. The forums are they're, they're pretty good. I got about five, I don't know, between three and five thousand members on the forum. A few hundred of which are actually active. <laughs> but there's some cool people on there. Um. Yeah. Oh, only other yeah. It's odd, you know, um, one other very short topic. No, I'll save it for another video. No, I won't. I'll talk about it now. Um, it's funny, or it's actually not funny. It's amazing how many people have met through me, through my forums, through my videos, through my uh, YouTube or live video. And uh, started to date and gotten married. Off the top of my head, I can name like three different couples that met through me and got married. One of which is now divorced. And that father and his son are sitting facing a wall. And the father's just like tell, tell, just staring at the kid and like talking with his head moving around. He's just like, I let you drive for two seconds, you little fuck, and you put us straight into a wall. You've been bugging me all week to take you to the go-kart track. I fucking take you, and you put us into the wall the second I let you take control. That'll be me and my son. A couple more years. I'm looking forward to parading him in public. Whew, zero, zero, zero. So I got one more lap. Last lap, you always purposely do some sliding. <laughs> I went up on two wheels there. It's the last lap, so they're not tracking the times, right? And there's Babao.
Hi, Bow Bow. You're a good. No, you stay there. Stay there. Good girl. It's okay. Ah, that was fun. Yeah, so check out my website, m13online.com. And if you're curious as to seeing the private series and you haven't heard about it in the past, then you know how to get it. No, you can't play with the camera. No, no. no.